In this morning's Business Insight, Cincinnati's nationally ranked Brandery Accelerator announced its class of 2017, which is the first under a new focus for the organization. The new class includes seven companies from a group of 25 finalists. Its four-month program began this past week in Over the Rhine. Each company receives $50,000 in investment, a one-on-one -on -one partnership with a local branding firm, and mentoring and instruction to help launch a consumer-driven brand. Joining us this morning is Tony Alexander, General Manager of the Brandery, and he's with Business Courier Editor Rob Daumeyer in the studio with more on the Class of 2017. Rob and Tony. Peg, thank you. Thank you so much for being here, Tony. Thank you. Let's roll back a little bit and not assume that uh, the viewers know a ton. Uh, in our world, you guys are a big deal, of course, but yep. uh, t what is the Brandery and when did you guys get started? So we started in 2010. Uh, the Brandery is what's called a startup accelerator. So uh, what we like to say is we want to help small businesses, and these are small businesses that already have a team, it's past the idea stage. Uh, we want to help them accelerate their growth. So that's either accelerate to their next level, um, or maybe they, we accelerate them to the decision that this isn't going to work out and smart right. people can try something else. So we have a four-month program that runs from June to October every year. Uh, 2017 is our eighth program, seventh calendar year um, since 2010. And uh, yeah, we've, we've seen some great success bringing these companies from outside Cincinnati yeah. here to help them build a business. Are you changing the focus at all uh, through the years up to this year? Is any, anything different about this year? Yeah, there is. So when we first started uh, in, in 2010, the goal was let's just put Cincinnati on the map. You know, it's no secret that Cincinnati is not known to be uh, a hotbed of entrepreneurship, or certainly in 2010, we've certainly come a long way since then. So we would take anyone and everyone. We put out a, a wide net. Let's get these folks to Cincinnati. Yep. Let's, let's sell the city. Let's give them resources, help them be a success. But as we achieved success and the accelerator landscape became far more uh, competitive across the country and across the world, um, the smart accelerators are starting to focus on what their unfair advantage is, what's something that we can do better right. than anyone else. And just think about the people we have here in town, uh, P&G, Macy's, Kroger, uh, all these branding and marketing agencies. No one understands the mind of the consumer and how to sell CPG and other physical products like Cincinnati. So yeah. let's, let's bring in those type of startups that are selling something. Um, they mentioned the, the protein powder uh, company. We got one of those in there this year. We've got two companies that make uh, soaps and shampoo. So if you're going to come to one city in the country to learn how to sell right. soap and shampoo, I think <laughs> Cincinnati is a pretty good place should be to this be. One. Yeah. yeah, and people should know that uh, the Brandery has a national reputation uh, for what you guys are doing. So even though you're not that old, uh, you really do have an outside. In accelerator outside world, footprint. eight yeah. years is pretty old. Good yeah. point. That's a good point. <laughs> so um, let's look forward to the future. You've, you've uh, worked with, what, 66 companies yep. uh, so far? Not counting this year's class. Right. But yeah. um, what are we going to see in the future? What are you, what are you guys going to try to be in five years? Well, that's a tough question. You know, it's, it's, it's tough to say in startup world. We have companies in our program now that aren't going to be the same company right. six weeks from now. So we like to try to stay nimble, um, and we'll just see what the future holds. I mean, we certainly have conversations around is this accelerator model that has been successful for so many cities uh, around the country and around the world, is that the best way to help these startups uh, or is it something different? You know, the, the Brandery is a nonprofit, so all the returns, we take a little equity in all the companies that come through our program, but all the returns that we've gotten, and we've had about 10 or 11 exits, um, go into an endowment. And the endowment's mission is just to further the entrepreneurial ecosystem in the city of Cincinnati. Right. That can take many forms. But right. I would say in the near term, the next couple of years, I think we'll dive deeper on this new focus and keep doing what we're doing. Well, congrats and, and continued uh, best, best luck to you. It's, it's, again, it's, we're, we're lucky to have you guys here and uh, can't wait to see what happens with these companies. We're lucky to be in Cincinnati. Thank right. you. Well, thanks for being here. Yeah.